Hi, I'm Christoph Ballin. I'm one of the founders and managing directors of Torquedo Electric Outboard Motors from Starnberg, Germany. Today I would like to show you the first genuine kayak motor on the market, the Torquedo Ultralight 402. Now, you may have seen other motors attached to kayaks before, but to be really suitable for the use on kayaks, a motor should be extremely lightweight, waterproof, mountable to most kayaks, and it should be faster than a kayak can pedal while offering a worthwhile range. We have designed the Ultralight 402 specifically for kayakers and specifically to meet these demands. It is a principle for us at Torquedo to design all our products along two criteria. They need to be technologically superior and they need to offer unprecedented benefits. In the next couple of minutes, I will show you how the Ultralight 402 lives up to that challenge. To mount the ultralight to a kayak, all you need to attach permanently is this little mounting ball. If you do not use the motor, the ball doesn't disturb much. If you want to use the motor, you attach it to the ball, you can connect it to the steering of your kayak, and this way you have great maneuverability. Or alternatively, you can fix the steering in any position that you desire. It goes without saying that you can tilt the motor, which is operated with this line. From the motor, this cable runs to a lithium manganese battery, which has a built-in GPS receiver. Now, what do we do with the GPS receiver? We combine the information from the GPS, the battery and the motor, and we display it in an information system in the remote throttle. There we show you the battery charge status in percent, the speed over ground, the power consumed by the motor and, most importantly, the remaining range based at your current speed. With this, you're always in control of how much further you can go. The entire motor weighs not more than just 7 kilograms or 15 pounds, and that is including the battery. This makes it by far the lightest driveline you can possibly have. It is completely waterproof. All connections are waterproof in connected and disconnected condition. And in terms of safety, you have a magnetic kill switch in the throttle. And should you capsize, the motor will also automatically stop. At the beginning I said a kayak motor should be faster than a kayaker can pedal while offering a worthwhile range. On a fishing kayak like this, which is the Hobie Mirage Revolution, we've measured the following speeds and ranges. At slow speed you will go some 4.2 km per hour for about 25 km. Or in American measures you run at 2.6 miles per hour for more than 15 miles. So we're talking about a run time of 6 hours at slow speed. At full throttle, you will run some 9.3 km per hour for 5.6 km. Or again, in American measures, you run 5.8 miles per hour for 3.5 miles. So at full throttle, you have a run time of little more than half an hour. For a sea kayak, which is less stable but runs better through the water, you can expect better values with ranges up to 30 km or 19 miles and also higher speeds. To get this performance from such a small motor is only possible because Torquedo drive lines are way more efficient in using the limited battery capacity for speed and range. To illustrate this point, the integrated lithium battery of the ultralight here has the same energy as containing 20 grams of gasoline or in US measures in two thirds of an ounce. I don't know any other company in the world whose outboards or drive lines run for 30 kilometers or 19 miles through the water on that amount of energy. So far, every kayaker I met who has tried the ultralight has enjoyed kayaking even more. We have designed the motor for kayak fishermen to take them to their fishing spot and for hands-free trolling. We have designed it for touring kayakers to dash through a local current and to continue paddling afterwards. And we have designed it for family kayakers to increase their range, to let them enjoy paddling longer and to make it easier for them to take their family kayaking. If you have any further questions about the Torquedo Ultralight, please contact your